Also, it might be emotional because we're going to finish this today, guys. But I want to let you know that we're going to be doing like a different ending for whatever I get, whatever I choose. Um, and like there's still more Witcher after today. So don't panic too much, okay? I'm also talking to myself. Did you like Anna Henrietta? Do you jest? I adored her. My darling little sis. So adorable. So sweet. Yet when they banished me from the palace, she didn't so much as peek out of the window. She might not have known. Maybe just couldn't. And could she also not grant me amnesty when mm. she was crowned? Please. That's true. That's true. Because I don't blame her as a kid not knowing how to deal with it. Half four leaf clover. Thank you, Rebel. Thank you, Atachi. Welcome on in. We're partying it up today with some fun times. Uh, probably until nighttime for me. Um, but yeah, what I will say too is like it's easy to put the blame on like the sibling or whoever you grew up with, but we're not talking enough about their parents, I fear. Oh, hi. Hello. Can we talk? Watch my head. Damn it all. I swear that was the last time I drank with Redbeard. Oh, Siana. A bloody long time it's been. You've changed. Whereas you, not at all, big bad wolf. Though it seems you've started running with the wrong crowd. Oh. And who should I run with, eh? Thumbelina? <laughs> One shot and she's under the table. But, 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 what brings you? But, 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 but. Oh. You could always have a drink with us. Oh, what now? Not on your life. I can barely stand, I'm so hungover. You know what they say about the hair of the dog? Out of the question. And why must you drink? Do you wish to drown some sorrow? And I don't mean Soho. to cry, but you don't look much like a young duchess to me. Duchess. They stripped me off my title and birthright, then banished me. A family spat, let's say. She was just a kid. Listen, it's looking for magic up. beans. Seen any? I was given one for safekeeping, but... Where is it? Talk! Shh, not so loud. Oh, I can be much louder than this. And resort to other means of persuasion. Uh, right there, the threats. <laughs> See, I need to a T. Listen, I exist to Wait, restage what's my game tale. category? If you want to play at it, I'll be happy to oblige. But it won't be easy. The thing is, little red riding hoods. Okay, thanks. Her clogs. Who did that, Ruby? What? A thousand times they cut Amadi? my gut open, filled it full of rocks, and drowned me in the river. So once you stopped coming, I decided to repay the little imp for all her loving labor. Ooh. Food now rots at the bottom of the well, she and the hunter, which means we can't play, and I'm under no obligation to talk to you. Not about beans, nor anything else. So leave me be. Sod off. It's interesting that we're like playing or working with the bad guys in the fairy tales. It's interesting. Hi, Cobble. Thank you. She's channeling everything onto her sister. Yeah. Yeah. It happens. It really happens because she can't. She can't really fight her parents. I don't even know a lot about them. Hmm. Wolf's pretty cranky. Surprised? Think about it. He was cast in the role of the nemesis without ever asking for it. Mm -hmm. It's a dog's life, I tell you. Yep. So, what now? Don't worry. I'll play with him. No, rather play him. See you later, Jackson. I just need that you. little red hood. The piece of apparel, that is. Not the poor girl's corpse. Oh, that's a relief. You wish to help me? Here's your chance. Jump in the well and fish it out. Well, chop chop.
Can't wait to see a dead little red riding hood. All right. Time to jump in the well. Break a leg. Hell yeah. Hi, Nino. Thank you. I appreciate that. How do I... It's not letting me dive. Oh, X. Which is not PlayStation controller. Oh! Oh, that's so morbid. Oh, my God. All right. Damn. I started watching House of Dragon last night. It's really good. It's very violent, of course. But I really like it. Yes, Val. I like it. I, I kind of like it better than like the first few seasons of Game of Thrones. I don't know. I feel like they're just... feel like they are kind of catching their stride and I sense some queerness I only watched the first episode I'm gonna watch more tonight who's Patty the main girl it's seven years today since we saw Sienna and Henrietta the spell is really starting to decay now, and some of the residents of this land are beginning to go mad. The wolf murdered Little Red Riding Hood, and the hunter, the witch, roasted Tom Thumb alive, along with the seven hang Forsians and the pixies attack anyone who comes near. We sought shelter in the clouds, but the giant drove us away. Our last resort is the ship of King Thrushbeard. We're planning to wait the worst of it out in the middle of a, a, a lake. What? Any luck? What? Yep. Look what I got. Why were they all standing on top of each other? Give it to me. How do I look? Um, really good. Oh no. Uh I'm not the not bad, not bad at all. Sounds too creepy. Let's do this one. Sorry. Don't know much about fashion. Yes, it shows. Oops. <laughs> Let's go see the big bad wolf. Let me guess. You'll play the granddaughter. Mm-hmm. And you, the hunter. You again? I thought I was clear. I will not talk to you if little Red Riding Hood is not with you. Not a problem. Sienna can take her place. What? Oh. Very well. It's not as if I can forbid you. <laughs> Granddaughter, come closer, sweetie. This is one but role play. Mama, what big eyes you have! They're nice acting. To see you with my dear. Oh. Granny, what big arms you have! Wait, this is kind of kinky. And grandmama, what big teeth you have. Eh? The better to eat you is, my dear. I love this.
What is spicy mission? Why is it spicy? I shall butcher you. Hello, come back. No. said about the red bean. A human has it, and he definitely didn't swallow it. Mm-hmm. Gotta open his belly. Ooh! Yeah! Auto caps, fake teeth, a corkscrew. Ah, here it is. Red bean. Well then, one step closer to our goal. You got this, Sienna. What's what? wrong? You don't want to leave? Well, I find myself wondering if you're just horribly discreet, or if those mutations completely scrubbed away your curiosity. Are you really not interested in what happened? In what became of me after they cast me out? Um... Oh! Who would do that? Well, I can see you really not liking her, but I'm interested. Well, since you brought it up, I'd gladly hear the rest. Let's see. They had escorted you out of the duchy. Yeah, that's valid. Yes. And the noble knights of Tucson, I didn't stop until we reached the Ketdu wilderness. They left me there alone, without a copper, in a torn lace dress, right when the frosts were setting in. They assumed something would eat me, or that I'd do everyone a favor and die of hunger. But as always, I failed to live up to expectations. Oh. I wandered the woods for a week, went purple from the cold, gnawed the bark from twigs. Finally, I saw a light among the trees. A campsite. They were bandits, bearded, drunk, spattered with blood. I was sure Reminds they'd me of Siri and the rats. Or both. Take it neither happened? That's when I learned a robber and a murderer can be a better man than a knight in shining armor. They took me in, yep. they set off Valid. from there, and I did what I could to repay them. I advanced in their ranks rather quickly. This is very Eventually, similar to Siri and the Rats. Of the whole ragged band. Because she was a, a kid. Should have stayed there, maybe. Perhaps. Perhaps I should have forgotten everything, started a new life. But you know what? There came a point when I thought, you wanted a monster, then a monster you shall get. Similar to Siri. Been through a lot. I have. And throughout this time, my sister was stomping grapes and shagging minstrels on down bedding. She wasn't the one to banish you. And I'm not angry at her for that. I'm angry at her because she forgot about me. She never did. Right. I don't think she We've did. We've had our chat. She, there was definitely inaction, but she certainly did not forget her. The way that she spoke about her and brought her up to Geralt was really sad. You can't just forget your siblings. Oh my God. But I understand why she thinks that. The Beast of Beauclair you get. Mm-hmm. I hope y'all don't see me as, like, totally forgiving her and stuff. Um, well, it's not even my place to forgive. I just... I love characters like this. I loved Renfrey. I loved Ciri's arc in... Um, with the rats. 
God, people were like, I hated it. They made her do this and that. I'm like, no, she needed that moment. Oh my gosh. Let's go. And I, I will ever, forever be grateful to Sapkowski for writing unlikable women that have like just unlikable monstrous arcs but also are Turn they have good sides Restores, to them too rebuilds, just very realistic one a bit too big the other too small the third just right oh Geralt you like your fairy tales magic food someone's eaten from our bones oops Oh god. Is she okay? Um, is she okay? <laughs> Melanie, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Thank you. Unicorn, please get out of here. No fear in the unicorn. Right, Janessa, and honestly, it's still, still needed with female characters. They think, like, oh, we'll just make a strong female character and we'll be good and we'll be feminist and it'll be great. And I actually detest the idea of a strong female character. It's like a trap. And they're either all good or they're all bad. You know what I mean? They can't be in between. I felt that with Danny in season eight. It really fucking frustrated me. Cause I'm like, you know that they can be flawed. They can be good and bad, Jesus. And as someone who's been through shit, there's been a lot of times I would have rather been seen as weak than strong. Like. I would have rather people seen my weakness rather than, oh, she's so strong because I felt like isolated and had to take care of myself and stuff. So, hi, size to learn. Exactly, Janice. Right, Joe. I mean, they, pro they probably assumed she was dead. That's very true. Wait, did Anna and Arietta know that she was alive at some point? Yeah, Aldis, for sure. So I visited the three bears. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Only one bean to go. Blonde curls. Rest of the body. Did they kill her? Mutilated. Hard to say anything. She got what she deserved, as I see it. Always took what she wanted without asking. No being here. Gotta keep looking. Should I eat this? Food? Pineapple? Not sure. Can I eat it? Is it edible? Faster. I'm so excited to see everyone's predictions of who they thought I'd choose in The Witcher. <laughs> it doesn't have any effect. Okay. Get it up. Um, let's go. <gasps> Wait, so can I pet the unicorn? Uh, maybe I can't go. pet this unicorn. Hi, Gandalf! Yes, we are! <clears throat> oh, I would love to see that, Declan. Um, let's Come go on, to the tower. You can definitely give me um, a general area. That, I wouldn't consider that backseating or spoilers because that's definitely something I would miss. Oh, it's at the end of the rainbow? Okay. 
That actually makes sense. Um. There should be treasure. I think he would look really cute in fairy tale armor. Really, really cute. Um, Sorry. Ah! Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Too late. this did i go i thought i was exploring i didn't think this was part of the quest oops um am i gonna miss my chance to explore pineapple no okay Thumbelina as a kid. I loved that one. It's probably going to traumatize me. But the original fairy tales were very dark. So this is probably more in line than the Disney-fied versions. <laughs> Meg, you don't want to know? It's very dark. So sad. Okay, cool. Wasn't Captain America like World War II? I think I just have to get her now. No, it's time to go. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. Thank you for telling me that. I didn't know that. Wow. 
that makes so much sense, though. Stan Lee is Jewish, right? Or maybe not. I believe so. Yes. The bean. Yes, he is, Adachi. Yes, he is. Leap of faith? Let's test out those ankles. Leap of faith, everyone. It worked. So? Got the bean, but long locks. Mm. Seems she got sick of waiting for a knight in shining armor. Can you blame her? Men these days, dandies and fops all. Mm -hmm. That's why you cozied up to a vampire. Except my husband. Dead love was a tool, and only oh, a tool. Oh shit, Janice was bad right. Didn't know that. I trust no one. Learned that long ago. Now it's his turn. Hmm. I think that she has some feelings for him, though. To use him. Was that your plan from the start? No. At first, I was simply intrigued. Do you know the story? It was in Matina, a few years past. I'd gone there to pass some loot off to a fence I knew. We were hashing out the terms when in walked Detlof. He said he'd come to sell a silver candlestick. He gripped it through a cloth. That caught my eye. I followed him out, observed him from a distance. But he caught on quickly. Yeah, superhuman senses will do that. He turned down a blind alley. I followed. He jumped out from behind a crate, baring his teeth. I suppose he'd wanted to frighten me. Alas, he didn't in the least. <laughs> After all, I'm a monster too, am I not? <laughs> That's sweet. Brave girl. A higher vampire and you were unimpressed? Don't know if that's brave or just plain foolish. I've always had a way with ostensibly dangerous, quiet types. That's supposed to be about me, too? Oh! oh mother, I hate to disappoint you, Geralt, but your belly button is not the center of the known world. No, you do remind me of him a bit, stifling all emotions inside. I'm taken. Ever feigning indifference. I'm taken. You see, when I met Detlaf, I... Somehow, I knew to call it intuition. You. That he meant me no harm. That he was trying to frighten me off, for he too was scared. Mm. Now, do you understand? Look at those poppies. Yes. I guess. Yeah, and the fact that she didn't run away meant a lot to him. Geralt is such a simp for sassy, powerful women. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He's a real man. What happened then? We talked. Then met up once, twice, three times. Enough that he became infatuated. I truly enjoyed it at first. But only at first. He did not love like a man. But like an animal, madly, oh. deeply, unconditionally. Wildly. To return such a feeling, anyone would be hard-pressed. Let alone someone as twisted as I am. So there came a day you just up and disappeared. Yes. There was no other way. Let's just be friends, or I don't deserve you. He'd never have understood that sort of thing. But then, once I decided to return, clean up some old affairs, I remembered him and concluded he could still be of use. Playing with fire, that. Definitely. And either I'll get burned, or I'll burn all else down. Oh. No other options. <sighs> Got a history with Detloff now. So this meeting will be different. Not afraid? I can handle him. Mm-hmm. Sure about that? You look at him as a witcher and see a monster. I... I know what he's really like. You needn't worry. It's time to go. Just a bit more work and we'll be able to say sort off to this fecking fable sphere. 
I think you're enjoying yourself. Now we must plant them by the path near Longlock's tower. Then prepare to meet the giant. Um, well, what I would like to do is go to the end of the rainbow. Dept. Dept. Laugh. <laughs> Hi, Dave. Good to see you. I don't feel like it. Let's go to the rainbow. Go, go. Sorry. Somewhere over the rainbow. Okay, I think I see it. The end of the rainbow. The end of the rainbow. Run, Roach. Oh, treasure! Treasure! did matzah i ate it <laughs> i ate it thumbelina close what is this happy b day meg any day of which game you will play after w3 um i'm gonna focus on assassin's creed we got some assassin's creed to get through and eventually i do want to play final fantasy i haven't played a final fantasy game in my life i want to play on the left i want to play devil may cry i want to play i'll probably focus on assassin's creed though um Oblivion, Skyrim, uh, Dishonored, Final Fantasy, Grand Theft Auto. I haven't played Grand Theft Auto. Fallout. <laughs> I know, we have so many games to play. Uh, sorry, I'm not sure where Thumbelina is. Greedfall. Um, I guess I could restart it. Maybe I could restart it. Oh, Aogard, that's very sweet. Kingdom Come. Close to the piggy's house. I think I remember where the piggy's house is. I play Kingdom Hearts. I love Kingdom Hearts. Uh, what else? What else? There's a lot I haven't played. Oh, I haven't played Sekiro. I'm interested in Sekiro. Wasn't the piggy's house like right here? Yeah, like this. Oh, yeah, there are. What? Oh, yeah, all the Star Wars games. Knights of the Old Republic. I didn't play Jedi Fallen Order. Oh yeah, Dreadwolf. Hi! Oh my god. Oh my god. You're gonna pee your pants? 
Okay, I'm gonna try to find Thumbelina and then we'll get to these presents. Maybe I'll do the presents um, once there's like a little stopping point. Why are, do I have one, two, three, four presents? Minty, I'm so excited. Okay, so here is the blown, blown down house. The poor P.O. box was like, <laughs> they were like, uh. They asked me, the guy asked me, he was like, he's like, Meg, Mage? Yeah. What company is this? And I was like, and then I was just like talking to him about it and he was like, that's really cool. Was it the same guy or a different one? It's a different guy. Oh, okay. <clears throat> that's cute. I thought they were going to get mad at me. Oh, this is so cute. Wait, it's miniature. <gasps> Here comes my chat. Um, wait, I don't think I can get in. <laughs> can I do you have anything to make me small so I can explore your town you stepped on some ah! that was my favorite tale huh? why is that because it wasn't about a princess tales about princesses are insufferable Oh, I want to play Persona 5. Not the blood. Was that the whole point? You guys just wanted me to step on her? I did not mean to do that. Anyway, I did not mean to do that. Did she have a quest? Oh, that's so sad. Literally, that's my favorite tale, too. I loved it. <laughs> Y'all are sick. <laughs> She's there to be stepped on. <laughs> Me. <laughs> Me with powerful women. Oh, Christian, hi. Thank you for the prime sub, by the way. The 11 months. I got very into um, answering your question. <laughs> well, that was a fun diversion. <laughs> that kind of traumatized me. I am shooketh. Wait, let's see. Come on. Run, Roach. Oh yeah, I loved throwing the baby in the oven. Yolo, yolo. Come I don't on, think Roach. I checked what she's selling. What is it, Luffs? Loves. What have you got to sell exactly? Oh yeah, the like unique armor set. To Where is that? Can y'all direct it to me? Okay, thank you. Small bodies of water. Is it just on the ground? Oh, in the middle of the water. But you said it was in the smaller body of water. Recognize oh. it. 
Once upon a time, a terrible dragon attacked Vizima. It took a clever young cobbler to bring about its defeat. Right. Every now and again, some village idiot tries to imitate him. And I gotta come in to clean up the mess. Just one thing in its gut. A half-digested sheep. Stuffed with tar and sulfur. Of course. Does that not disgust you, poking about in a rotting corpse? Compared to the time I fought a Zugel in Vizima's sewers, this... <laughs> Never mind. Don't feel like telling that story again. Is it this? Nope. I love the references to Polish fairy, fairy tales. Can't get out. Keep heading eastwards. Okay. This one? Oh, here we go. Night Strange. Doesn't look like he's out of any fairy tale I know. Wonder how he got here. In past times, on a reality. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just excited. Oh, cute. Oh, goodness. That's very cute. Oh my god, he looks world. so good! So some sneak into the playroom, then into this land, in search of their fairy tale damsels. That's all. Oh. Uh... Shredded to bits by a swarm of pixies. Iron is delicious. Oh yeah, the sword. Amy, Ami. Was it a silver sword? What did I just pick up? Oh. oh, nice! Hell yeah! I love that. Best sound ever. Ruby. <laughs> Vit Vitus means like a grapevine. Very too song. I'm obsessed with this armor. That's really cool. Grapevine. Hi, Petunia. Are you a good girl? Yes. She's such a good girl. The puppies have been very sweet to me today. They've been giving me extra cuddles. That's it, right? What you doing underneath my desk, girl? Hi, Maddie. Um, I'm pretty far in. Uh, this is my first playthrough. So we do plan on finishing the expansion today.
Don't you still have a side quest here? I don't think so. I did the duck. Right. This is the spot. Pull out the I did that, yeah. Duck, duck, goose. The egg. <gasps> Exciting! Wait. Why? The stalk will sprout abruptly, very abruptly. We must be careful. Siege, thank you, and thank you for the sweet right. birthday message. Hi, Jimbo, thank you. <laughs> nice. The color palette. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Uh oh, it's gonna spread out. It's gonna spread out. Uh, no, no, go get back, get back, get back! The home stretch. Oh my god, she's strong that she can climb that with him. That requires a lot of upper body strength. Incredible. Oh. Back to reality. Oh, there goes Admire gravity. The view later. First, we must deal with. <laughs> him. <laughs> oh, are we still in a fairy tale? I don't know. Hello, good to see you. Cloud giant. Hi. What the fuck? What is happening? Um, pineapple. What oil should I use? Cursed? A uh, giant hybrid ogroid beast. Okay.
camera. It makes it difficult for me, which I like. It makes it feel more real. I want to loot it. For a fairy tale creature, that was one tough son of a wench. I told you this land had gone ape mad. It feels more I RPG. It so severe. Can't help thinking you might have done that on purpose. Why ever would I have? To get rid of your guard, your captor. Getting close to the exit at this point. Probably think you don't need me anymore. Well, you're wrong. You still stand to be quite useful to me. Oh. That's so? How? Plan to use me like you did Detloff? No. I need you for a purpose far simpler. Well, don't just stand there and stare. I need a man, Geralt. And I'm not afraid to say it. I have no idea what awaits me once we leave this place. Treat it as my last wish. Um... Not the last wish. Uh... Will I get in trouble? It's my birthday. It's my birthday. Oh, I did Shani. Yeah, I did do Shani. Whatever happens in fairy tale land stays in fairy tale. I love that it says, let her have her way with you. I didn't get an okay. Like with Shani. Okay. Birthday fun. Okay, everyone. Um, don't look at me. Uh oh. Oh. On a cloud? Wait, what? Wait, what? What just happened? Oh. Oh, this is beautiful! Wow! Avatar who? Oh, Spider-Man kiss! They're floating around. We'll cloud bang, okay? Oh, she bit it! His butt. I saw his butt. Oh my god. Oh. I'm gonna get banned. <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> oh. I don't think I... I didn't ever see the PB romance scene, did I? Or... I don't remember. What did I just walk in on? Ah, uh, we're having some fairy tale fun time. They're just like, oh, okay. Just gonna go our separate ways. No parting words. Oh, did you, you have a big heart. Actually, that'd probably be best. Oh my! No woman's ever treated you this way. Not that I recall. No. In that case, Yen likes last to you cuddle. Felt what so many women in this world feel at times. Yes. That's true. Just like getting the, getting the clothes on and go with, you know, go, go, go. Yen likes to cuddle. Oh. <laughs> this, I don't think I don't know which one to choose. Wait, yeah, is that laugh gonna be mad at me? <laughs> well, I just hope this tale has a happy ending. Yeah, that's for yeah. me, for you, for everyone. That may very well depend on you. Oh, what's that supposed to mean? Nothing beyond. Hey, Caleb. Power. For now, I don't have water. Come, the exit's this way. That laugh's gonna be like, what about bro code?
Well, I think she wanted to do that because she didn't want to be Detlaf's woman. Like, she didn't want to be his possession. I got a greater red mutagen. And so I think that was her way of reclaiming. Thank you. You're welcome. Reclaiming it all. I can do this. Yes. Yay. Someone on YouTube was like, let's see if Meg actually ever researches mutagens. On the last video, even though I have freezing art. Another will of the wisp. To be honest, I don't really look at the Witcher YouTube comments anymore. So I feel like I'm so close to the end, I don't want spoilers. What was it? I don't understand. What did I just get? Sorry, I was in like... That... Oh! Is it this? What the fuck? But I have Erendite. But this one... Has all the... Oh... That's so cool. Dark Souls Easter Egg. Oh, it's for the night armor. Oh my gosh. I'm going to do... I love it. Thank you. Dark Souls. That boss kind of felt like Dark Souls because like this is the vibe of Dark Souls. Just curious. Why do you want the heart of Toussaint and the ducal wine? They were my right, my due. Mm. Doubt we would have figured you out if you hadn't tried to get them. Know that, don't you? I do, and I regret nothing. One lives but once. Hell yeah, yellow. Here, we need but jump into the well. You first. It's like a hot tub. Yeah, but it said maximum level 40 for Erendite. Uh oh. Oh. Portals in a fountain? Not terribly practical. It was a secret passage. Anariet and I would use it to... Hide from your governess. Which luckily she noted down in her diary. Thus I knew where to await you. Nice. Oh! Never mind that. Has the young lady agreed to help clean up the mess she's made? She has. Yeah. And stop treating me as if I were a child. Yeah. Nice. Would you prefer I treated you like the lying manipulated you her? I mean, she is kind of acting childish because her trauma has her stuck as, like, a kid. Um, both of you, stop. Calm down, both of you. But... No buts. 
Let's go. Really want to be done with this. Yeah, seriously. place isn't it? it offers a lovely view of the valley on a clear day you can see the outlines of Duntine is it though a ruin like any other I think uh, so sensitive so aware honestly what did Declaf ever see in you Perhaps he's like tell you himself. bro code He's like, you broke my best friend's heart. You nervous? This rage is mm -hmm. very done it's with her. It's always a bit nerve-wracking meeting an ex. Especially so when said ex is a vampire. I doubt he'll be in the mood for jests. Oh. I know. Oh, may I be honest? Yes. I'm nervous. I really would prefer just to run off. I gave my word I would help. I know. But how much is that worth? Yet I owe him this meeting. Aww. And that is that. I feel like she is being honest. Let's get ready. Dadloff will be here any moment now. I love his nails. Wish I had nails like that naturally. Vampire nails. Yeah, we'll see. Um, I definitely want to check out the other endings to this. I thought I would be able to see the Elder Vampire. Hello, Detlaf. Uh-oh. Rude. What? Did I hurt your feelings, sir? Oh. He's stuck in traffic? Oh, I need to stop. Ollie, thank you for the reset. Ren. Sienna. Sienna. I have a question I must ask you. Did you truly feign it all? That which bound us was a ruse. Dead love. It's not that simple. Yeah, it's not that simple. I... Oh no, it's very simple. You either deceived me or not. In forgiving you, I grieve. For now, we must part. What? But how? I've been fooled again. She will pay for this sooner or later. She will pay. Wait, Do what? Never a metal butcher. Huh? The ribbon I bought or I won? He was gonna kill her, that motherfucker!
I swear, if Rageous perishes. Sir. Please, enough! Uh oh. Oh no. No! Oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh god! No! Silence! You silence! <laughs> you silence! How you like that silver? No! Oh, let's do. Okay. Mmm, great. So let's. <laughs> you know, part of me wants to be hopeful and think that maybe that laugh. Um. Maybe Detlaf saw the ribbon. No. <laughs> and he knew where it would take her, but I don't think they have a relationship like that, really. Natsu! You go! You go! Wait, what? Nice place, isn't it? Wait, oh shit! Is it? Ugh, oh, I'll I you. should save, huh? You nervous? Mm -hmm. It's always a bit nerve-wracking meeting an ex. Yeah. I don't hear oh. you. Oh, yeah. I know. Shay, thank you for the dollar. Let's get ready. Hey, hey. Sorry, what's the... <laughs> Not okay, your turn on but what is this armor? <laughs> no fashion souls pass from the He looks at the same thing. Sanch. <laughs> Ollie, thank you. Okay, so can I? Oh, prepare for the fight. So. Blood and wine. That's a lot of red liquids. Prepare for the fight. Is there? Well, maybe it just means like black blood, back blood. Spartan, thank you for the hundred bits. I appreciate it. Twitch offered me something not to. Caleb did the same thing. He just saw a button and he pressed it. That is so funny. That's why I love you too. Saw a big button and he pressed it and didn't give any explanation. <laughs> Kevin, Unifex, thank you for the thing about the topic. I appreciate it. Okay. I want you just a mess. You tricked me. Enough. Both of you. Didn't plan any of it. Yeah, it's going to be enough. Oh, you piece of shit. Not who I loved your song so much. It was beautiful. Um, I don't know why I did that. Oh god, this motherfucker. Not a high train! Who did that? No more high trains. Enough. Vampire oil if I survive. I tried it. It was beautiful. Your name. Vampire. 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 vampire yes. I wonder if I can parry his shit. Oh, where's the music? This is so creepy. Oh my god. It's kind of creepier without the music.
DLC. Flashbacks to man bat. True vampire form. I thought it was a bat. I thought it just looked like a a bat. I heard that last phrase a lot. Yeah, maybe me too. Definite legit haunted. Happy fucking birthday. You happy birthday. Thank you. I mean, <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying happy birthday to myself. Uh, happy. Thank you for the happy birthday. I have to do this all over again. Great, 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 great. Um, I think that I can also let's let's get a. Hmm. Uh, I, I liked it for a bit, but I think I might change the close camera. Yeah. Uh, let's do this. Maybe it's gameplay. Thank you for gifting a sub to Hachi. I wish you could lower some of the button. I want you just the nuts. You tricked me. Both of you. Didn't plan any of it. Silence. Wait. Oh, why did I do that? Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, so you press R2. I'm not doing any damage. I don't know where he is. Not me with my crossbow. Fucking Quen. With the Quen. Oh, 
Oh, nice. Oh, that's like the health potion. Okay, cool. Oh. dodge out of the way of that should i like block you must run and dodge but it's timing right run sideways Well, now I, I think I got it this time. Oh, I tried.
Okay, phase three, I think. I must admit, it's kind of satisfying. I'm doing open heart surgery. This is what a broken heart feels like. <laughs> he needs to put on some all time low and deal with his breakup in a healthier way. This is the problem. I think he's going to regenerate. Yeah. I got your picture. I'm gonna <coughs> come in with you, dear girl. Carol, call me in. There's a story at the bottom of this bottle on the pen. Jeez. You can come back on one condition. You gotta be good. <laughs> Leave him to me. Be gone. I can't let. I insist. Oh. He's not looking too good.
like that for rages. He just said, like, ugh. this guy saved him. Maybe I want to do the other ending. My, what a smashing ensemble. You wear it well. Shut up. I look like a twit. The caftan is sewn of the best fabrics available, and according to the best tailoring practices. But one must have a modicum of taste to appreciate this. Even the most exquisite robes cover only deficiencies in beauty, never in refinement. usually wear something different, better suited to my trade. Got nothing against this particular outfit, though. Just don't exactly feel comfortable in it. And I despise formal occasions. Hmm. Nothing what one are, can't get accustomed to. Are we doing, now, like, court be so trial or something? to stand still. All that being as it may, Toussaint's highest honor, the Order of Vitis Vinifera, demands appropriate attire. The Duchess Trapes cannot fine. be expected to drape the medal on a suit of armor caked in mud. Palace protocol places enormous okay, emphasis dude, on Okay, dude, I won't... I don't... didn't forget tradition. how you fucking it, kicked my ass huh, in Gwen. A tradition which values appearances ahead of all else. Which calls for lordly, glistening triviality and misplaced generosity. <laughs> Sound wistful. Pensive, Regis. That because they refuse to buy you a new outfit? <laughs> Hardly. It's the tone I ever adopt when I find myself pondering, which, believe it or not, happens quite a lot. No. Oh. Besides, I've no need for a new outfit as I shall not be attending the ceremony. Why not? Because unlike you, I don't have to. I shall begin to pack my belongings instead. I trust you'll join me later, once you're richer by a medal and a fascinating new experience. Count on it. Hmm. Ceremonies, medals honoring virtues. He can't, Just keeps he's like. Coming up. <laughs> I've had no reprieve either. And I keep thinking of the last great virtue, compassion. It's the one piece of the puzzle that never seemed to fit. Mean you suddenly believe the five virtues theory, after all we've revealed? It's not a question of belief, superstition, or old wives' tales. It's a conclusion derived through exercising pure logic. Siana planned everything in advance. Had we not stopped her, surely there'd have been a fifth victim. One the gossips would have associated with a lack of compassion. Her plans don't matter now. Can't act on them. Her sister? Ask the messenger who delivered my invitation to the ceremony. Siana's in the palace. Courtiers pressured the Duchess to lock her in a tower. Oh, come on. I mean, Do I guess that makes sense. you care not who else was in her black book? We've some time before the ceremony. We could still chat with that boot-cleaning urchin. Oh. He was the one to pass the <laughs> victim's names to Detlaf. Perhaps we missed something. Regis, Boot Black didn't say anything about making deliveries when we talked to him. Oh. How do you know he handled the letters? While you basked in glory and tried on new formal wear, oh. I conducted a little investigation of my own. You'd be very proud to see how I conducted myself. I began by concocting an ample supply of boot wash for our enterprising young friend. I'd observed that among street folk, amidst their society as a whole, reciprocity takes precedence over Rages. all other codes, <laughs> and thus no good deed goes unrewarded. <laughs> of course, the same holds true for malicious or destructive deeds. The letters. What's the connection? <laughs> when the boot black arrived to collect his bucketful, he hinted he knew more. The Simply alliteration. Put, we'd failed to ask the proper questions when we chatted earlier. It took a bit more tongue loosening, but ultimately he spoke. He admitted he'd handed Detlaf the letters. He knew this information was valuable to me. In providing it, he was simply repaying me. Um, okay. What? Does this matter? Pineapple.
It's just m whether or not I fast travel. It does? Oh my god. <sighs> you should know with the prompts. It just says, you're right. We need to talk to the boot black. Let's go. Not bad as ideas go. Let's meet there. Uh, oh, okay, yeah. No, that's all I meant. Fast travel or not. You guys oh, are no, silly. Check up on that. We'll go together. Oh, I see what you're Assuming saying. Yes, you thought I meant I like between. Okay. Yes. It lies in your hands now to see if you are able to present my handiwork at the ceremony with the dignity it is due. Okay, okay. Or if you will first destroy it, crawling okay. about the city's yeah. underbelly. Why are you Promise like to be this? Careful. Hello. Hello. Um, your niece is awake. Oh, I should take a, a break then. Yeah. But it's in the middle of the. Let's just see. Okay. Oh, That's very sweet. It's Thank the you. Swordsman. Okay, I said, I said Good to see you. Scene. Okay. Here for a spiffing? Dirty boots are a stain on professional dignity, you know. Step on up. Need to ask you something. Oh. Go on then. I'm a proponent of free speech and I will gladly tell you all I know. But why not get your boots shanked while we jabber? While we jabber? Guess they could use a spit and polish. <laughs> then I shall take advantage as well. Oh. A friend of mine used to say boots should be as clean as the soles that wear them. Clean boots, clean soles. A fine slogan. <laughs> Carol does look good. How are you doing, little friend? How's business? Well enough. I can't complain. I love him. Though it would be even better for certain folk to sit down for a shine as they stood and chatted. Man in the frock coat. You passed him some letters, remember? Why, of course. I'm young. Got a mind like a steel trap, but... If you're about to tell me this information will cost me, forget it. How'd you get those letters? Beckers brought them. Why didn't you tell us this before, when we first talked? You didn't ask about beggars now, did you? <laughs> beggars. Tell us more about them. How many were there? Why? The Madame four. of Toussaint is One the same voice letter. as this Just kid? Four. Sure you didn't get a fifth? <laughs> Don't count, you know. <laughs> Remember anything else? These beggars have anything in common? Oh my but god, what a talent! On. It was different. Some had mismatched boots, others had no boots at all. Sir! Oh, I know! They all had no home! <laughs> oh, kid, my patience is starting to run a little thin. <laughs> now think hard. <laughs> He's such a little shit. I love him. Where'd they get the letters? They pick them up? Get them from someone? I don't know. They'd come, hand me a letter, and walk away. I asked no questions. Geralt, allow me to ask a question. Listen, lad. I'll be glad to mix another batch He's of that boot better shine for with you. this kid. But you must focus now and tell us all you know. Where can we find the beggars? Little chip. <laughs> well, at the shelter, most like. Where's that? Everyone knows. It's just round the corner. Up those stairs, then right. Thanks, kid. For your trouble. Cute. We must visit the shelter. Look around inside. Optional. Find the shelter. Yes, I would like to do that.